right, this is a very fast tour of our villa because we need to check out. Entryway, washer, dryer, hallway, kitchen, very nice. Didn't use any of it but the fridge. Fridge, microwave, oven, sink, dishwasher. There's a bedroom in here that Megan stayed in. Beep, 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 coming through. <laughs> Queen bed, window to the hallway, closet, cabinetry, TV, full bathroom. Dining area, great for remote work. Seating area, TV, really nice screened in porch, golfing, pool, humidity. Main bedroom, king bed, chair thing, drawers and a TV, another entry onto the patio, another window. This vanity, a tub that has jets, but it's kind of strange, and this closet. You might ask, where's the shower? It's in here, it's small, and there's also a toilet. I don't know why this decision was made. So, and if you're ever here and you're looking for extra towels, they're in these cabinets. So, this is the Marriott Royal Palms. They also have the Sable and Imperial Palms. Those are also villas. I think they're like various sizes. Um, but this is on the same property as the World Center, the really tall Marriott property. And you can access their pool and stuff too. They have a shuttle, but it's under construction this summer, which is sad. So we went to the water park <laughs> but it's a great stay here it is sunday morning we're trying to get out of here and we're going to wilderness lodge i was gonna try to show the really nice view but it looks like it's foggy it's just the camera but we had some golfers here on friday morning and that's the pool area this is right off of world center drive right here um in 5 35 so it's a good location Goodbye, Villa. Megan's stretching her back out. Stephen's hunting oh. wabbits. Buffalo. Buffalo, oh. I think there's one nearby. I thought there was, maybe not. We've arrived. Oh, it's big. Show me your haul. Well, I got this. Because <laughs> we always have to get one of these at the Fort Wilderness. Oh, it's Fort the Wilderness, Wilderness Lodge. Wilderness Lodge <laughs> gift shop. And, wait for it. Corsica. Well, it's so it's nice. Fine. It is textured slightly. No, it is not. Um, it's no, I mean, it's kind of like the soft. Kinda I know, like it's soft. soft. It's like matte. It's yeah. a corksicle, so I don't know if we were talking about this yesterday. But, like, they have, like, turvis and corksicles at all the resorts. Branded. Good stuff. Even like this one. And I got the um, beach club one. The turvis. And then at Polynesia, I don't know if we said this last night, their gift shop was closed, which was sad. Megan pulled up a picture of their turvis and it's like brown, like all brown, which was kind of the same way at Wilderness Lodge. I don't know why they went with that color. Contemporaries was like a teal, which was really pretty. Um, and Boardwalk is cute. Has which one? It's, brown. it's just like a brown turvis, like a brown lid. I wonder if it's like and it was, I can't remember. It's yeah. It was like, it's fine. It's, I think better than the Wilderness Lodge one, but anyway. We're just waiting to join the walk-up list for oh my God, Geyser God. Point. I want to go see the Geyser. Sliding. Do you want to go outside or want to sit inside? Um, I look so pale. I'm like, I swear I spent the day at the pool yesterday. Yeah, update, breaking news. They don't have waffle fries at Geyser Point anymore. What? She's told me they're McDonald's fries, which McDonald's are my favorite. Fries. Like, because I don't love waffle fries. I'm more of a McDonald's. I'm definitely a McDonald's fries person. 
Yeah. So I have high hopes. We're just surprised this wasn't on the Twitter Diz Twitter. I know. Feed. I can't find anything on it. I still want to know what happened yesterday at the water park. If it I'm not doing surgery. But yes, with the water park. Um, we just got in there. We're walking to the Lazy River, and we heard like whistles. We're like, oh, whatever. Triple whistle. And then these lifeguards were like sprinting towards the wave pool, and it seemed like everyone was like a little concerned over there. But we just got in the Lazy River and ignored it. But also didn't want to like gawk. So I wonder if anyone knows what <laughs> happened on June 19th at the Blizzard Beach Wave Pool. Let's know. But this is the best little spot for lunch. They aren't taking reservations. I don't think, have they ever taken reservations? Mm -mm. You gotta do a walk with list. There's Bailey. It's so perfect. A nice big open pavilion and a bar. I don't see anything on the fries on Twitter. No fries. Situation. Okay, I got the grilled portobello salad with salmon. So we got the bison burger and fries. I think a turkey sandwich and fries. They are McDonald's. Yeah. And then we got a little ducky friend here wanting food. I'm sorry. And may I get a side? I was supposed to feed you, but people have, so now you want some food. Sorry. We had a delicious lunch at. Guys are points. Fries were good. Fries were good. Um, that quinoa mushroom veggie salmon thing I had, super good after having like junk food all week. But I will be ending with a Mickey bar in a few minutes. But Steven, did you like your bison burger? Good as always. Good as always. Yeah, he's had it before. I'll it is really good. Yeah, there's like a jam. It's really yummy. They have good sauces there. Like yeah. the turkey sandwich has like a cranberry mayo that's really good and I'm not usually a big mayo person. They elevate their food with like yeah. good condiments. They have like little apple Yeah, my salad had it. like balsamic and goat cheese in it. It was really good. Um, so we're glad we went here instead of, we were originally looking at Ravello at Four Seasons, which Steve and I just did in January, and then Boathouse, their brunch, which is newer, but we just didn't really want to mess Disney Springs and glad it's a Sunday. Do, like breakfast. We yeah. did the buffet, well, not the buffet, but the all you can eat yesterday, so I feel like yeah. we're kind of maxed out. <laughs> right, yeah, no, we woke up this morning, we're like, we don't need waffles and pancakes, that, yeah. but that was really good yesterday. Yeah, that was a good So day. we're just going to walk through the DVC Villa lobby, and then go to Roaring Fork and pick up some treats, and then we'll get on the road, because there's apparently some traffic. I don't and know if it's like the weather that's slowing it down. Too, yeah, I don't know if it's rain, because there's like the storm coming through Georgia. I mean, I'll be honest, like, we've never hit traffic coming to or from, so that's weird. So it's probably the weather, or maybe it was just a, maybe it's gone now, I don't know. Yeah. But that's the plan. Yeah. Is the fire on? Yep. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> so cute. There's like a big rocking chair on the patio, like a double one. Ooh. Oh. Oh, there's people. Be a good place to work. It would be. I worked remote at um, Wilderness Lodge. Okay. I should have come over here. I mean, I, it was fine up there because yeah. they have so many nooks and crannies. Yeah, this is a good resort to work remote. Yeah, as long as you can find an outlet, you're good. Oh, I didn't think about that. Yeah. And like, you don't have meetings. It's not like quiet. And this is pretty quiet, <laughs> but yeah. I bet you, I wonder if someone's done like a video of like working remote in Disney World. Probably. You should do that. I feel like that could, like, if I lived here, I'd do it, but I'm like not gonna dedicate a day to like. I'm surprised like Tim Tracker has it done there or something. But it's so nice. This is the train room, DVC. Lots of seating. There's another seating here over here. Little porch.
Hey, you look good today. Look at you. Look at that. It's called the Roaring S'more. That looks really good. I don't know. I'm excited. And yummy. I got my Mickey bar. Yeah, let's try it. Stephen has a rice crispy treat. We are departing Wilderness Lodge. Everything's done and finished. Sad. But Megan will be back in November with her family, which will yeah. be fun. They'll be going to the parks. And then Stephen and I will be in Orlando in December doing Universal, but we have the days open to do stuff. So who knows? I'm sure we'll be back on property then. But it's been a great trip. We're gonna head back now. Thanks for coming, Megan. Thank you for having me. Thanks for coming, Stephen. <laughs> I mean, I enjoy this, so. For a second there, it looked like I was gonna be the only one coming. So I know. glad it worked out. I'm gonna go study for finals. And thank you, Aunt Karen, Uncle Paul. Yes, thank you very for much. For your villa points. <laughs> yes. So, yeah, Megan's gonna go study now. We're gonna drive back. Peace.